Bon dia! Today we're going on a photographic tour with one of Rio's most famous photographers, Ulysses Padilla. We're going to highlight some of the options of locations that you can go to and he's going to teach you how to take amazing photos and the best part of all is that he's going to take very professional photos of you visiting all the classic sites of Rio de Janeiro. Come with us, let's go explore your options. Option one, Parque Lagi. Parque Lagi was a former sugarcane mill turned aristocratic mansion and now is a modern day art school. Uh, Snoop Dogg made it very famous in the 90s with his video Beautiful, which I'm sure you all remember. There's also a fabulous French cafe on the inside that you can stop and have a bite to eat right after your photo shoot. Welcome to option two of your photographic adventure. We are in the Jardin Botanico, which is the botanical gardens of Rio de Janeiro. It's 55 hectares of beautiful flora and fauna. We're going to visit today the orchid garden, the Japanese garden, the amazing 200 year old palm trees, and all the other little details of the garden that may lead us to see monkeys. Come, we'll show you now. of Jardin Botanical. It's where you have the 200 year old palm trees. And we're gonna walk down it and take amazing photos. Brazil is home to the second largest population of Japanese people besides Japan. Here is a little example of their influence on the country. Come with us to the Japanese garden. take just a little brief walk and go visit the orchid garden. This is my absolute favorite area of the botanical gardens because there's these enormous fish that look almost prehistoric. It doesn't really work to film them, but take my word for it and when you're here you can see them. We found monkeys. Take a look. at the Maranchi Dona Marta, the Dona Marta view. From here you get a 360 degree view of Rio de Janeiro. Starting from Christ the Redeemer behind me, to the north zone of the city where you can see the famous Maracana football soccer stadium, the port of Rio, and all the way to the south zone of the city, including Sugarloaf Mountain, Ipanema and Copacabana beaches, the lagoon, Laranjeiras, Botafogo. It's an incredible view. Come, let's take a look. It's such an incredible view. From here you can see Leblon to Ipanema Beach, the lagoon. You can see all the way to Copacabana, the cemetery of Botafogo. Sugarloaf Mountain, Guanabara Bay, the beach of Flamingo, Santo Simon Airport, and way behind you can see the suburb of Niteroi 
and the longest bridge in South America. Now we're at the Vista Chinesa, the Chinese view. The pagoji behind me was built in 1903 to commemorate the Chinese immigrants who came to Rio to cultivate tea. Come, let's go take a look at the view.